the feds get those books, our whole operation's at risk. Tommy. Tough day today, Tom. We gotta keep a lid on this, Tom. Start with Biff, but don't give him nothing. I got your clean set of wheels. And something special here, if you want it. When Frank sees a Lapara, he'll know. The old ways work. You gotta get those books back before the feds use them against us. Tommy, what's the rumpus? Heard any big news lately? Something that Don might want to know. Uh, depends. What's it worth to you? 20 bucks. How about 40? All right, spill. The FBI is in town. They're getting something from Morello, but I, I don't know what. How'd you hear? Little Tony got some guy drunk in the Black Cat and drove him home. Heard a bunch of stuff, so he's the guy you want to see. Okay. Thanks. Always a pleasure, Tommy. Everything okay, Tom? No. No, it's not. 
What's this about the guy you drove home who's with the feds? They came in for a drink, which turned into ten. He's hired muscle for some kind of safe house. Where? Oak Hill, corner of Pine. He gave me ten bucks to drive him back and keep my mouth shut. Let on that Councilor Gilatis brokered some kind of deal between Morello and the FBI. They were all ready to sit tight on someone in there. Why the hell didn't you tell us? Tom, I did. I came in to see Frank straight away. He didn't tell the Don? No. No, he didn't. Tom, what's going on? Looks like the place.
Take me to those account books, Frank. Be some kind of meat happening. Shit. They've taken you to the airport, Frank. They're flying him out of state or something. Fuck, this ain't good. just flashed a badge at me and forced me out. Airport's closed to the public.
Don Morello's, I'm sure of it. There's some guy the feds are handing over before he's flown out in a civilian plane. Anyone know what's going on? They're with the FBI. It's some sort of handover. Someone's being flown out. Well, they're handing him over to who? Those men with the plane look like gangsters. How long did it done? I'm due to fly. As soon as they fly their prisoner out, I guess. No, a lot of these men don't look like cops. Like you? Nah. Uh, Get in the car. Always forget your bicycles. Sells long enough for the scales noses. to tip. This is gonna be some day in court. Toxic invasion, money laundering, corruption, smuggling.
lighting in one of the hangars. Tom. Frank. The Don sent me. I figured as much. I'm sorry it had to be you, Tommy. Anything you want me to tell him? I wish it could have shaken out better, but Morello finally came after me. It's okay. You can come out. Morello offered me a simple trade. The Don's account books for our lives and tickets out of this town. You hand the books over, yet? I'm not so stupid, Don. They're safe. Morello was waiting for this. It's a key to a box in the Grand Imperial Bank downtown. I told Morello I'd hand it over after the plane was fueled and ready to go. His men were meant to fetch it before we left. I took care of him. Tell them to get on a plane. Go on, March. Alice, get aboard. Frank, you're coming with us. Not right now, honey. Just get buckled in. Tommy and I, we have some serious business to discuss. But Frank... Get on the plane, March! For Alice. For me. Get on the goddamn plane, please. You been paid yet? Yeah. Now you've been paid twice. You take the ladies wherever they want to go. Yes, sir. Thank you, Tom. Christ, Frank. Why didn't you ask us for help? I guess I just wanted out. One way or the other. I'm tired, Tommy. Tired of lying to my wife. Tired of checking under my car every time I take a Sunday drive. And tired of waiting for the dawn to put two in my temple. Damn you, Frank. Sir. Where's the safety deposit boxes? With my colleague downstairs, sir. Thanks.
beautiful day, huh? Uh huh. Keeping out of trouble, I hope. I need to access the deposit boxes for Frank Coletti. Ah, yes, Mr. Angelo? Uh, yeah. Mr. Coletti said it might be you who came and to provide access. Please, follow me. Got the books and covered my tracks. Salieri never asked any questions. In fact, apart from the funeral, I never heard him talk about Frank again. Making my boys twitchy, Marku. Sergio, when I just came by to pay respects, that's all. Known Frank a long time. Almost as long as you. He's a good man. Smart. Loyal. <laughs> Loyal to his wife. His kid above all else. There must be some kind of honor in that in you. Maybe. But I'm still looking at this headstone with his little girl's name on it. Look at these houses. Big yards, white picket fences. It's the American dream, eh, Tommy? I suppose. Not for you? No, sir. I don't like being closer to the business. Don't let the flower beds and front porches fool you. There's more criminals out here than in the rest of the city combined. Are that why we're in the neighborhood? In a way. Merle's got a dirty prosecutor on his payroll named Watkins. Turns out he's old friends with Galati. The city councilor? The same. Morell let drop that we might have had something to do with the Galati boy's death. Now Watkins is loaded for bear, trying to do right by his buddy. Word is, he's striking gold with a few witnesses. You have names? Yeah. But Paulie and Sam are taking care of them. I'm putting you on a different part of the job. We need whatever Watkins has got on us. Well, where's he holding? A safe in his villa. <laughs> I'm no safe cracker. <laughs> Don't worry about that. We're taking you to meet Salvatore. He's fresh off the boat, but he knows how to pop open anything. Just get him into the villa, find the safe, and he'll do the rest. What kind of rumpus should I expect? Nothing you can't handle. Watkins is going to the theater, so the house should be empty except for a bit of muscle. The office is on the first floor, and our stoolie says the safe is in the wall. Once Salvatore has the safe open, grab all the evidence and get out. That him, boss? Yeah, that's our guy. Salvatore, tutto bene? Si, grazie. Don Salieri. Good to see you. You know the job. Don't let me down. Si. Who capisce you? Tommy, if you bump into Watkins, don't kill him. It'll just bring down more heat. You got it, boss. Buona fortuna, ragazzi. Tommy. Tommy Angelo. Piacere di di conoscerti. Meraviglioso. <laughs> 
per favore. Parli almeno un po' di italiano? Il capo ti ha detto il piano? Uh, I don't speak Italian. Eccellente. Ah, fantastico. Uh, no plan? Yeah, the boss told me. Ah, uh, please. Uh, uh, understand. Entriamo dal labirinto senza farci sentire né vedere. La cassaforte è dietro un dipinto al primo piano. Dammi un po' di tempo e lascia fare tutto a me. Quella cassaforte avrà sicuramente un allarme. Uh, yeah. This is gonna be a long night for the both of us. Ah, Cristo Santo. Ok, my turn. Do what I do. Do not get caught. Sì. You gotta keep safe. Safe? Sì. Uh, it's um, uh, my job. Apro cassaforte. Open safe. Christ. Ok. Radio. Let's listen to the radio. Eccellente. A volte questo paese è stupendo. Ecco. Entra I take out the guards. A quanto pare in America hanno il labirinto. Yeah. <clears throat> I wish I could have a night off.
Sei un tipo tosto, eh? What? C'è un'entrata. Open. Kick. What kind of luck, Pitty? Look for a dipinto. A uh, what? Caravaggio, uh, hai capito? Painting? You're saying it's behind the painting? Si, si. Okay, I understand. Non quello. Guess we got another room to check. here. There's one. Guess we got another room to check. There's one. Are you sure it's behind one of these, Salvatore? Who are you? Ma'am! Ma'am! Someone help us! Stay out of our way and you won't get hurt. There's one. Nothing again.
Uh, uh. Scusa. Sure. Show me what you can do. Shit. Be quick, Salvatore. Pacenza, pacenza. Doesn't matter. Come on, we need to get out of here. Vai dietro, dietro. They gotta be upstairs. I'm safe in his study. Salvatore, stay back! I'll deal with him. Hear that? Move into cover! Get your first time. Forza! Andiamo ce n'è! Presto! Semina gli sfiri! I know! Whatever you're saying, I know! Police? Dio. Salvatore, where do I take you now? Home. Yeah, where home? Uh, uh, six and uh, Maple. Okay, let's go.
Tommy, devo dirti una cosa. Al nostro prossimo lavoro penso io alla casa forte. Hai capito? Ci ho quasi rimesso la pelle in quella villa ed è tutta colpa tua. E impara almeno un po' di italiano per rispetto della nostra patria. Ah, è come parlare al mio cane, lo so, ma Cristo, dovevo dirlo. Non farlo mai più, mai più. Ok, ok, uh, sure. Good night. Night. This is the last of the good stuff, boss. I know. Some of those bottles I've had for 10 years. But we gotta make payroll. Get it out of here. Convert him. Load it up. Good to see you, boys. Boss, any word on a job I pulled with Salvatore? You did fine, Tom. Galati's got nothing on us now. We bought some time. At least until the money runs out. Don't go selling off the farm yet, boss. Sam says you worked out an angle. Yeah, and you're gonna love it. We make a few bucks and knock out a couple of Morello's teeth, too. Okay, what's the rumpus? A couple of weeks ago, I'm relaxing in the cigar lounge at the Blue Tropics. Where? Some small-time whorehouse. It's just a couple of closets with some mattresses on the floor. It's a gentleman's club. They got a bar and everything. <laughs> Anyways, one of the Johns is south, and he's crying to the madam about all his troubles. He catches my ear on account of his goofy accent. He's going on and on about how he just landed this huge payday. But the goons he's working for are already twisting his arm. And he's got the busted nose to show for it. You pick up his tab? Hell no. But I walked him out of the place, took him to the diner around the corner to sober up. We get to talking. Turns out his name is Gates. He's this hick up from Kentucky. Moonshiner? Uh-uh-uh. Better. His pop's got a couple of real distilleries, and I'll give you one guess as to their exclusive buyer around these parts. Morello. And you think he wants to burn bridges? Oh, yeah. I've been working him steady, boss. He's bringing up another shipment tonight, but he's got his entire crew ready to roll over. All we gotta do is make it look like a proper heist. I don't know, Polly. You really trust this guy. He's got no love for Morello, I'll tell you that. Not like we got a lot of options here. Mm. We'll be cutting up the last beam pretty soon, boss. What do you think, Tom? We need to replace the Canadian. If Polly says this Gates can do that, I'm in. Where's the meat? The big parking garage downtown. Okay, do it. But you better not be playing grab bass this time. You take Carlo and little Bill with you. Sure thing, boss. Once you have the truck, drive it back here. We won't let you down, boss. Don't make me regret giving you some time out there in the streets with the guys, Carlo. You don't have to worry about me. I know I don't. Tommy does that for me. I'll keep your drivers safe, boss. Bona fortuna, boys. Sam and little Bill said to meet him downtown. 